at this point, it's just it's not even on the radar, so I can't uh, say that that will probably happen because I don't think that it will. But you know, I'm really happy in the retirement. Honestly, I've just been really enjoying myself and figuring out a little bit more about you know who I am beyond Misha the fighter. And it's been a very interesting process, so I'm really enjoying that. And and I don't have any plans to come back or even any desire to want to. So unless that drastically changes, I don't see myself going back in there. You know, it's, it's an all or none sport. It's got to be 110% or not at all for me. So, you know, unless, like I said, something makes me want to just get back in there like a, a crazy person, then I won't be. of Bisping against Yoel Romero, which is probably going to be the next title fight for Bisping. I think the next fight for Bisping is me and Bisping. This is makes sense. Now for the title, you mean? Yeah, of course. But if they were to give Bisping the title fight against Yoel Romero, if they said it had to be Yoel fighting for the title, who do you who do you think matches up better in that fight, Yoel or Bisping? Uh, I think Yoel Romero wins. And are, would you still want to fight Bisping if you all had the title, or would you rather fight Romero for the title? My focus is my fight now, but uh, Bisping is my focus because Bisping no win the last fight, you know? Against you? Yes. Okay. Uh, now, if Bisping loses the belt, um, what, where do you see yourself in the middleweight division? Like, let's just say that you win this fight and Bisping loses. Do you think you are next in line, or do you think someone like Jacare is next in line for that fight? I don't know. I'm just waiting, but for more, makes sense for UFC, for the show, for money in my back, and the money in the back to Dana White, me, and this thing. This is makes sense. Now, you have said that you would be willing to uh, be bumped ahead of Jacare to fight for the title, but you would not fight him. Why would you not fight Jacare? Because we're friends, right? I think if there's an opportunity to fight for the cinturão, I'm going to fight, but I don't have the pretension to fight with Jacare because we're friends. Because we're friends. If I have the opportunity to fight for the belt, I'm going to fight, but I have no intention of fighting Jacare. He's my friend. Let's go. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Come on, 13. Don't turn. Don't twist. Come on. There you go. Keep going. Keep going. Time. Good. Switch. You can train anywhere. You can even train, I don't know, with a fluffy heart pillow. Watch. Are you ready? Absolutely. Go. <laughs> Hi, I'm Joanna Champion. This is Michelle from Perfecting Athletes. This is my tough face and Michelle's tough face. Ah! We fight for cancer, for uh, little cancer fighter, uh, tracker, uh, we team tracker. So I challenge to my friend, Adriana Lima and Amanda Nunes, show me your tough face, remember to tag team tracker. Ah, we fight with the cancer. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.
excited. They had a glimmer of hope. <laughs> They're getting pumped up. My man right here, he definitely, he definitely wants some hope. <laughs>